what's good earth signs welcome to your empress raven read for the new moon in aries um if you aren't already following me over on youtube make sure you go ahead and give me a follow at empress raven and let's step right into your messages okay so as i was shuffling and just feeling out the vibe you know i'm earth sign so i'm like okay get out my business you know my business living too much i ain't hush now um i immediately heard it's just it is now time for you to be like super super vulnerable and i and i'm talking about like the world needs what you got like be in complete utter like confidence and just vibrating your outward expression um I'm, it's like this message of you sit on so much wisdom you sit on so many like i don't know it's just like this just je ne sais quoi you just got that thing you got that it okay herb sign <laughs> you know shout out to my virgo virgo risings Capricorn, you know it's, it's a lot anywho um <laughs> i'm not being biased we still getting that ass handed to right here so let's let's just continue to get going get into it okay so this new moon in aries oh i cannot make this up this flew out before i can even ask the oracle because you know i am the oracle but new moon it's this new energy so the um the fire signs got new moon in cancer and the earth signs are getting new moon in leo so serving you possibly being around a leo or just that fire energy at this time is really uh warranted at this new moon in aries confidence is your key to success i literally can't make this up all right so let's continue to dive on in in terms of where you are right now on your path the earth signs sun moon rising venus cap Taurus, Virgo, you are the Eight of Wands. Go, I'm hearing go, go, go. By common, like, and on the count of three, go. Like, ain't nothing to it but to do it. Pedal to the metal, like, er, skirt, skirt, like, like, lane switch if you need to. Dip in and out, do your thing. Show them what you all about. Make it rain. I don't know where they came from, but maybe you need to start rapping. Rapping and trapping made it happen. All right. Oh. All right, and the death card, we're going to step into it. We're going to get into it, all right? And I, and because it's this energy of the new, the, the, it's a new way for the earth times to relate with life, okay? It's, it's a new dawn, it's a new day, Nina Simone, like, I'm feeling good. Dun, 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 That's where we at with it, okay? What was crossing you up right now is, guess what? The king of wands. You need that fire energy. You're getting crossed up as, as far as your confidence and your ability to assert yourself as the boss up leader, the initiator that you are, okay? Um, cardinal sign, Capricorn, you know? <sighs> Taurus, that fixed energy. Like, get it, let's get it. You know, Virgo, like, mutable. Like, you're able to do all the things. Literally, you got all the skills to pay the bills. I need you to act like you know that. I need you to, with this new moon in Aries, to initiate ah, practices, moments, create opportunities for you to show up and show out, okay? And it's with conviction, it's with confidence, it's with clarity, it's it's from that knowingness within. Um, it's like these energies like, and I also feel like you're gonna get a lot of messages or just um, opportunities business ideas um trips things that are going to take you out of that comfort zone going to take you out of that you know aloof type of energy that that we sit in a lot or just that chill i don't think you're going to be chill right now this is not a time to chill it's a time to get it get it popping it's a time to get it popping and so in terms of what you need to know you need to know that self-deception is what is keeping you out of your your healthy processes and prizes that lead to like your bitcoin your okay like is you not thinking that you have the ability to it's you not thinking that or believing cuz believing is the magic is you not believing in your ideas enough to 
bring them to the true fruition or possibly believing in your relationship but it's like this energy of belief because the self-deceit you keep too much i feel like you keep too much old stuff or just like maybe possibly doing this new moon energy new moon and aries energy you're going to be getting rid of all that like old residual energy from like I don't know. I, I, it's like this energy of like some people just have had you fucked up. Okay. And that's just essentially what it is. And um, you've possibly been in your head keeping all that stuff close, keeping those comments or those situations or those, you know, um, replaying those old scenarios that just was never, it was like a projection type of thing going on or it just wasn't, it was, it was, you got to stop believing folks inability to see the vastness of who you are if you don't believe the vastness of who you are so it's just like uh external validation that's what does that's what is that's what is really like what you need to know is you deceive yourself by continuously needing other other people situations relationships things to to validate who you already know yourself to be so i need you to stop keeping that icky that uh like girl stop making other people's limitations your limitations because you're really not afraid of nothing and you really know you big and you really know you you got that life and you really know you can really get it done and get it popping and manifest it like that so this is like a lesson of what you need to know is that uh keep it keep it your business like keep it make it your business to keep yourself clear of other people's fears and limitations because that that's what helps you that's what makes you then step into this place of deceit where you don't be feeling like you can do what you knew you can do because you just you just sat at the altar and got the idea and asked for the clarity and then you're gonna go run into somebody else and see if they understand it baby your mission ain't for nobody to understand but you this ain't got nothing to do with nobody but you okay so earth signs sun moon rising cap virgo leo get it together because you're being dared like i dare you right now as your capricorn self right now the devil I dare you right now to be confident, to be for show, for show, to act like you know, like, and believe that you know, and and go for what you know. Like, I dare you, I dare you to go beyond your comfort zone. Like, I dare you to post a twerk video. Like, what what is it? What is it that you are doing that you have not? show the world yet again that you can do because you are a limitless being that can do and be anything anywhere anytime and it's just like i guess you just thought that you just gotta just be dim your light to fit in or you need to be more relatable to people's averageness when you are way beyond average okay shout out far beyond average when you are far beyond average okay <laughs> i'm gonna need for you to uh, to 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 unchain yourself, to release this attachment to, well, I just gotta be small so everyone else can shine, and then I'm, a, and then as everyone else get on my wave, I'm gonna then beam them some more, so they're gonna always have to catch up. Why is you basing your moves based off of people's ability to, to see you clearly? Only person need to see you clearly is you. Again, this energy of self deceit. Stop stop slowing down your process stop slowing down your growth we grow at different rates at different phases and different different seasons and trends as it is not your responsibility to make sure people can keep up with you lap lap these folks three four times if you need to because you can do that because you put in the work you create the systems you master what you do okay cap virgo uh taurus it's 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 just in you it ain't on you and it's just it's not for you to i feel like shallowly always attest your poppingness to materialistic things when you're rich in spirit you're rich in talent you're rich in advice you're rich in so much okay and i just seen 909 999 maybe you're really completing this like i said i feel like this this new moon is is helping you sweep out this residual energy so you can can, you can just be free i'm like a bird i want to fly away like that's the vibes okay and so you're being asked right now to exercise your will which is to place your focus and intention around temperance one foot in the water, one foot on the ground, but I'm always pouring from a full cup. Listen, I'm present, I'm grounded, 
I didn't fed myself what I needed and I can give you understand that Capricorn that unconditional love Virgo that that unconditional that ability to see the details Taurus that ability to just stick it through that we gonna we get it for the long haul okay like that being in your element in your body and one with your emotions like allow yourself to feel and like I said be open be vulnerable be about that life okay because can't nobody take nothing from you. Can't nobody, can't nobody take nothing off you. Including yourself. You have so much. Um, like I said. This is this energy of riches here. But you got to know how to move and shake. And what to do. I know what to do with it. Maybe you just need your back blue out. Okay. Like. <laughs> listen up. Okay. It's this energy of like girl. <laughs> so taking everybody too serious have some fun like balancing personal life work life spiritual life, like all of that is like i need you to be like water okay but make the intent to to stand to stand in it and feel it through like complete alchemy is being presented here and the way in which that you need to just practice restraint to keep like okay this is this is what you need to just okay all right and that is around this card right here we got the energy of death but you know this is doing nothing but shining light on that dual energy shining light on that the need to allow all of this old or um like i said clean up this residual energy sweep it all out the dough once and for all replenish yourself okay your ego okay you could definitely be experiencing an ego death at this time like in 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 allow it like I, I need you to witness it this is the energy in which you need to be the observer i need you to be so present and in, in your higher self because this is all higher self energy this is you dominating this three-dimensional this life experience this vibrational experience from a higher learning so i need you to allow the ego to be in your back pocket because in order for people to in order for you to believe it's almost it's also giving me this energy of quantum leap i need you to show up as the final result like i know myself personally i'm always like oh when I got this and I'm like that, did it stop waiting to have all the money, all the support and all the things and be that master, be that full energy of the co-creator right now. Quantum jump. Leave that old shit behind. Let it go. Okay? Because at the bottom of the deck, you got the tower anyway. It's got to happen. Like, it's no way, it's no way around it. So let's go ahead and see what ideas my eye will help you better deal with this ego death, okay? What ideas my eye will help you better deal with this ego death? We have the card of I am humble. And so, and I know often I'm like, how are you going to talk about all that popping on? Eh, and then you say, I am humble. Again, we have temperance here. Balance, bitch. Okay? You can know you to, sh but by... You know what to do and how to do, but don't deceive yourself. Don't. This is not about dimming your light. It's about knowing how to. At times, like I said, that light dark. That how to how to flex that subtle power energy and when to dominate because this energy of going forward and and not taking no prisoners is here. Like so, in terms of I'm humble, I know we as a people we have been fed that word and it has a lot of um, oomph with it. But I'm going to tell you like this. I am humble enough to sit. Look at this imagery. Just look at Just use your intuition to use with this imagery at this time. To, to see that I'm the cosmos made conscious. And to know that I am that, that I am. I am all things and in everything. Connected to everything. Attached to nothing. It's that energy of humbleness. Like, again, higher self perspective. Okay? Like still moving with integrity intention and intimacy while knowing that i'm all that in this um all right so if this message is resonant for you go ahead and like it you can send some money to my cash app because you know i like money money energy exchanges always work in my books okay um 
like subscribe share comment all the good stuff if you want a personal right now go ahead and go to the links in my bio the universe wants you to know that your fearless freedom lights up the world craig the world light it up happy new moon aries